Welcome guys to the Unreal Engine video. In this video, I'll be showing you how to create a Morphle run inside of Unreal Engine. Okay, let's start. So what you're going to want to do is go into Games, hit blank, next, I'll call this Unreal Marble Run. Call this whatever is going to be the name of your Marble Run. Leave these settings as default. And then hit create project. Okay, let's wait for that to load. This usually loads really fast. So don't worry. Okay. Here we are in our world. So now the next thing you're going to want to do is right click. Create a new folder. I'll call this maps. Head inside of there. Then right click. Create a new level. Call this main run. Call this whatever you want to. It doesn't matter like at all okay so then go to modes want head inside your map then go to modes landscape select the material you want to use i'm going to use grass for this tutorial because i think it looks best then hit create okay let's go back to select and then under visual effects you're going to want to drag off a few things oh wait no first in light drag off directional light put just to raise this a bit under visual effects, you're going to want to drag out sky atmosphere and exp experimental height fog. And then over here in the atmos over here in the light, to make it look nicer, you're going to want to scroll all the way down until you see atmosphere and cloud, or just search up atmosphere and cloud, check it, and now we have a sun with dynamic clouds and everything. Okay, now the next thing you're going to do is now we need a builder run. So let's start with that. If I hit play. Okay, we are in our scene. So I'm going to drag out a cube. Let's select that. Why am I still with that? I don't care about plugins. Let's go to 2050. That 50 seems good. Um, one, one on the y axis. Actually, maybe two. 1.5. Okay, that looks good. And then oh, I'm going to make this 100, or however you want this to be tall. Why is light getting weird? Okay. And control S to save. Remember to save your project all the time so you don't lose it. Okay, now for this tutorial, I'm going to do a very simple dropping. Let me know if you want me to continue this tutorial and cover some more advanced stuff. So I'm going to get a Q. It's a light on the other side. Why does this look so weird? What? Oh, it wants me to build the lighting. Okay, we can do that after. So, now let's scale up our cube. On the Z axis to... On the X axis to 5. Let's make that 10 actually. You know what? One, two. Okay, yeah, that'll work. Now I'm going to drag off another cube. This is to make sure that the marbles don't roll off the track. And let's... I keep forgetting Blender versus Unreal Engine. Make that two. So that way they won't fall. I'm going to make this a bit higher. Okay, here we go. Now we have our platform to put the marbles on. Um, Get a... Here, we need to make sure that it won't roll off, and I'll show you how to do that in just a second. Okay. What if we just make this a bit smaller? 
zero point eight by zero point eight by zero point eight. And now that looks like it'll work. So the next thing you're gonna want to do is under mobility, change it to movable, and hit simulate physics. So then if we hit play, we can see that now it's simulating physics. Um so what we can do next is let's duplicate this a few times. And these are gonna be all the marbles in your track. Uh if you want them to have textures, then just go to materials element and then just select a random texture. I'm just gonna dis for the sake of this for the sake of time in this tutorial, but I can make another one on how to ha make these have tested textures. So let's make this whatever color that is. Okay, perfect. Now we have four marbles with different textures. And now we can start. So then the next thing you're going to want to do is add component, move. Where is Okay, so then let's just rotate this a bit. One. And they're rolling. And they're falling. Okay, that seems about good. So now let's I'm gonna want to duplicate that. I want that uh, I want this to be at the higher slope. Let's make that five. Okay, that'll do. And then I'm gonna rotate this to be negative twenty. Let's move this down. I'm gonna put this down like that. And another one there. Okay, now if we hit play, then now we have the first part of our marble run. There goes one. Okay, and I'll show you how to fix that right now. Um, select your the back of your marble run. Hit Control W to duplicate it. Then press it right against the marbles. And then scroll down. Where is it? Maybe disabling the shadows would help. There we go. Uncheck visible. So now there is an invisible wall that will make sure that the marbles won't fall. See, now they can't fall off the edge. There goes our marbles. What a cool and exciting marble race. Okay, and to fix the big shadows, go here, build lighting only. And this will build the light. And it should remove the shadows from here. Wait until it finishes. Okay, there we go. This is so much better. I mean, is it though? Is it really though? Eh, I mean it has to be an improvement. Building the lighting. Once this finishes once this exports, then it'll look a lot better. And now, in the meantime, we can keep building our marble race. Okay. Just finished. And now we can see our marble run. This looks so much better. Okay. Now I want the marbles to gain speed. So let's just put this at an extreme... No, not, I didn't mean to adjust the scale. Let's put this at an extreme... Maybe not. Okay. 
Let's try this. And I want to lengthen it a bit to 30. Now our marble should be picking up speed at this point. And then let's make them a ramp. And just launch them over there. There we go. Let's test it. We have our marble run. Our marbles are going down. Which one will win? Here we go. This is going down. Green is going down. Green is going down. The drop. They're going up. Which one will win? And it's green. Perfect. And now, uh, let's add some music. Actually, no. Yeah, no, I'll cover that in another tutorial. I have actually a really handy tutorial on how to add music. You should just follow it. Uh, it's going to be right here, top right corner. Yeah. And you can do that into your role run to make it auto start playing music. So it sounds a whole lot nicer. Oh, uh, we can add, we can make this rotate, yeah, let's just add like an obstacle to make the marbles rotate, if we go here, just duplicate that piece, control W, and then make it movable, add a component, rotating movement, oh no, not this. Rotating movement. And then if we hit play, we can see it's rotating. It's not rotating the right way though. Which, there we go. And now let's see how this affects it. Okay, we're going down. The hit one of them got it. Oh hey, all of them got it. I want it to be rotating a lot faster, so let's make that 400. Let's move that down a bit. There we go. The marbles are going down. Oh yeah, there we go. And now it looks like that one's going to win. And that one just won the marble race. Okay. Yeah, I guess that's it for Marble Racing Part 1. How to make a realistic marble race in Unreal Engine. So yeah, if you enjoyed this tutorial, please subscribe so I can make Part 2. And show you how to make moving elements, add sound, and record it with using camera captures and render it into a movie. So yeah, please subscribe, leave a comment. I'm responding to every single comment people leave. For a limited time only. Yeah, it's definitely a limited time. So yeah, just leave a comment down below. They all help. Bye.